In this video, I'll show you how you can make money with your website. The most common monetization models for such websites are charging users for adding and promoting listings or taking a commission on every transaction that occurs on the website. The first monetization model I would like to show you is charging users for adding listings and making them featured. Featured listings appear at the top of the search results. To do that, we need to install the free HivePress Paid Listings extension. Simply go to the HivePress Extensions section and proceed by installing and activating the mentioned add-on. Also, it's crucial to install WooCommerce, a free e-commerce plugin, since it will be used for accepting and processing payments on the website. To do this, Go to the Plugins, Add New section and find WooCommerce with the search bar. Then click on the Install Now button. Once it's successfully installed, proceed by clicking on the Activate link. Once you activate WooCommerce, it will automatically launch its setup wizard. You should go through all the steps to set up payments for your website but I'll skip it in this video since every website has its own unique details and payment methods. The starting point is to create the WooCommerce products that will be used for payments. To do this, go to the WooCommerce products section to add a new product. Here you can set the product name, price and mark it as a virtual product. It will be used for charging users for making listings featured. Then click on the Publish button. Also, let's add one more product to link it with the premium listing package we'll create later. Great! Now navigate to the HivePress Settings Listings section and select the product we have just created. Also, don't forget to set the featured status duration in days and save changes. Now, let's check how it works. To do this, we can open the website home page, then go to the user dashboard, pick any listing and click on the star icon. As you can see, there is a redirect to the checkout page where users have to fill in the form and proceed to payment. The selected listing will get the featured status once the payment is processed. That's how it works! Alright, now let's create some listing packages to charge users for adding new listings. Go to the Listings – Packages section and click Add New. For example. I'll create two packages, a free and a premium one. Let's start with adding a free package. Enter the package name, describe it and set the maximum number of listing submissions. Then click on the publish button. After adding a free package, let's add a premium one. Simply enter the package name, fill in the description, then Set the maximum number of listing submissions and finally select the WooCommerce product that we have created previously. Also, keep in mind that you can make listing packages category specific by assigning them to corresponding listing categories. This way you can sell different packages depending on the listing category or you can make certain categories free. Everything depends on your website niche and requirements. Finally, click on the publish button. OK. Now let's try to add a new listing to check how everything works. Simply go to the website home page and click on the list a service button. I'll briefly fill in all the fields and submit the listing. As you can see, users have to select one of the packages to add a new listing. And if they choose a premium package, there is a redirect to the checkout page. Now 
you are familiar with two monetization models. In the next video, I'll show you how to set up the set one and charge commissions on booking appointments.